Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be playing Spongebob Squarepants Battle for Bikini Bottom. This is going to be a full let's play. Uh, any percent. Not speedrun, but just playing through the levels. I'm going through one level per video. But for the case of this video, it will be the, uh, Spongebob's house. The start of uh, Bikini Bottom, like the hub area, and then Jellyfish Fields. And the next episode, we're going to be doing mm, uh, Downtown Bikini Bottom. So anyway, without further ado, let's get started. Welcome to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. Today is the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. By the way, I'm Bikini playing on the PC Bottom version. To get demolished in the process. Oh well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicatotron 3000, I'll clone an army of robots that will wreak mayhem and destruction at my command! One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one is Plankton a genius. Answer yes! Okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch! <laughs> Welcome, my perfectly obedient robot army. Hang on, I want to get a photo for my scrap. Oh, hey, hello? What do you think you're doing? Oh, no, 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 wait, wait! But I'm your master! I made you! No, no! Oh, my good China! Another perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah, only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. Bye. It's not just any shell, it's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real robots to play with. But Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did! So, okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Vita Schnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? Sure! Last week I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell, then I said the magic wishing word and shook it, and in the morning I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. The next morning. <laughs> Gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Whoa! Uh, Gary, did you do that? Wow. Yeah, Gary, it sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Wow. What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Meow. Oh, okay. Press this button to read the signs. Mm. Meow. 
So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. All right. I now. made myself a snack, but there's no time! Now, the sneaky way of doing this is you get all the kitchen objects... All the kitchen shiny objects. Get the ones in here. She's pretty. Can't take it! I then get a you note get from Mr. Krabs! And it even smells sweaty, just like him. Ahoy there, SpongeBob! Ahoy. As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've been, er, promoted to head shiny object collector. Wow! A promotion! That's right! A promotion! So what this here new job entails is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me. Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. I make myself a snack, but there's no time! Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. Yeah, I'm gonna go in here. is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Oh, smack that button. And then... This is where I keep all my old comic books. I love opening presents. Alexa, stop. Hit that. First part of Bikini Bottom. Ah, there's nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Yes. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting Ooh. my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. 
Sorry that I'm not talking as much. I already know what I'm doing because I played the original like so many times. I know the entire story. So I'll just... Pretty much for the whole dialogue, there will be no talking, and don't expect my reaction to much. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. They even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. F in the chat. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bend all my forks? Well, maybe you deserve to have your forks bent. Not the forks! Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you can get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas in your dreams. You've got a hmm. deal. Yeah, I really do like the whole animations. They bring more life to the characters. Hey, Bubble Buddy! You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. Right, press this button and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you. Try it out. These guys. Hey, Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Well, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Yeah. Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. Hey, you. Patrick needs to do laundry. Right, let's go under here. Living under a rock. Now that's the life. I love opening presents. Before I go in the Squidward's house. Yes, the golden underwear. Now I can wear four pairs of underwear. This is great. Fresh like a spring breeze. There's a better way to do this, but I'm... For the sake of uh, the game, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do everything the way the game intends you to. It shines! Those stupid robots ruined a perfectly relaxing mud bath this morning, and now you show up. Can my day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Patrick and I were just playing a game and- Oh, I correct myself. I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I, I fix didn't... everything? The new, uh... Animations for when the characters are talking make the game look so much better and give it more life. Why don't you move to another town? That should help out more than enough. 
move to another town. I, I cracked me up. <laughs> but seriously, just jump around like an idiot. That should at least make me smile. <laughs> I didn't know Squidward had a lamp. Oh, achievement. Nice. I didn't know Squidward had a lamp. Okay, okay, okay. Just stop jumping, will you? If you take this golden spatula, will you please go away? See, Squidward? I knew that you could help me out. Don't touch me. Okay, one thing I don't like is that when you when you hit the painting, Squidward doesn't say it. Hey! Patrick will be glad to have this back. I will be comparing things to the original in this series from at least of what I remember. Can't go there yet. Jellyfish, of jellyfish fields, fields. Nice. a place to experience nature at its most raw, and sometimes a bit tender from the stings. Of course, it's always good. One thing I don't like is that those cannons are always going. Because if you look in the back corner, you can see the cannon going. I really don't like that. Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! Okay, that face is funny. I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j -j Jellyfish! Well, I guess you're off to scale Spork Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> I'll stay here, balled up here in excruciating pain. You do that! Don't worry, Squidward. I'll bring back that King Jellyfish jelly for you to rub all over yourself. Yeah, never really understood that line. Yeah, I know what it means. It's just I never really understood why they put that in there. Jellyfish today, I'm going fishing for robots. I feel like a new sponge. I love opening presents. And also, I'm going to give my honest review of the game. Met a sponginator. Oh, sparkly! Hey, you! Patrick needs to do laundry.
also, don't expect me to do well, because I am not... I am still very new to the YouTube thing, and don't really know how to commentate well. As you can probably guess if you've watched any other videos on my channel. Just my side! Yeah, this vi this whole series is going to be based on a casual player of the game. Now, the reason I know the whole story, be because I've been playing it for the last uh, about six months or so. I've been playing the original, um, uh, I got started in it, because I just wanted to play it again, because I realized how good it was. I didn't really get back into it because of the whole speedrunning community, how I discovered that after oh, I started really looking more into the game. Back. So, yeah. And then this got released, and then I got more excited. And all I have to do is wait for it to come out. And it did come out. Because for the longest time it stood on the Steam page as when I'm ready. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, a date. So, yeah. Okay, these cannonballs are definitely bigger. Hey Gary, what's shaking? Wow. Wow. I mean the game just looks amazing. Wow. The a Unreal Engine def just gives it spatula. something special. Push, push, push. Also, I don't like that the ham is just ham. It's just metal that's painted like ham. I liked it when it was actual ham. That's the one thing I hated ever since the early version of it, is the fact that the ham is not ham. The squishiness of that ham, I really liked about the original. to go. But there's more over here I need to get. I come back with the bubble bowl later. Actually, there is nothing else over here. Except down here.
man. Clearly, I'm not as good as I thought. I am failing. Well, you can't be perfect at everything. Fish caves. Wow, Mermaid, Mermaid Man. Man! I have all your comets and toys and mail. Uh, huh? W what? Oh, yeah, it's that sponge kid. And now, what was I supposed to tell you? That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! Massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. <laughs> by clipping... Here I come, Patrick! Okay, yeah, that's just amazing. Light time. Hey, you! Patrick needs to do laundry. That was a ton of fun! I should do it again sometime. Another fine for Patrick! Open up the box. Like a spring breeze. I feel like a new sponge. Pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Nope. That failed. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. SpongeBob. Woo! Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the. Oh yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. I thought you said it was a golden turkey baster. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Not.
flux. Ooh, a present in every one! Sparkly thingy. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look. And you have one of these. You throw that on there. Whoop. Uh oh, this one goes boom. Kaboom! Barnacle head, watch where you're going. The rock is talking to me. Almighty rock, I am at your command. Down here, you big pink lummox. Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knock-off wallets. <laughs> oh, thank you. Much better. That's not where I want to put it.
Right, I did it. Hey, slide time. Oh, Ouch. that's much better. How many of these do I have to carry? Quite a few. Have you been lonely out there all alone? Oh. They don't even have that purple shiny object that used to be on the ice. I will crush them! Ooh, again! Again! I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Collecting a special just completely avoids the damage. There. Ahoy there! Squidward tells me you're looking for the King Jellyfish. Yes. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can find him up top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor! Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. Mrs. Puff. Hello, Patrick. I've got a job for you to do. Oh, boy. I found a golden spatula, but those robots out on the island stole it and threw it into the lake. If you can figure out how to get it back, you're welcome to it. Show sure enough, Mrs. Puff. SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right.
love opening presents. Fresh like a spring breeze. Cha ching! Feel like a new sponge. Tartar sauce. So Nice. You've just met the Spongeinator. this bag. Feel like a new sponge. Nice, nice. I'm gonna check something. Yeah, I have not sold so Mr. Krabs yet. This way. Fresh 
fresh like a spring breeze. I don't like that camo. to help out today. Step quietly there. That king jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck. You'll need it. Thanks, Bubble Buddy. This was feel like a new sponge. Could actually be pretty difficult. I knew the King Jellyfish was big, but who knew he had such a beautiful voice? <laughs> Like I said, this the boss is actually pretty difficult. Like a spring breeze. Much more difficult than the original game. Oh my gosh! What I is like this? A new oh my god! Yeah, I'm gonna fail. Like a, spring breeze. a few times. Hey, Hans. They definitely upped the difficulty of King Jellyfish. I mean, it was pretty easy in the original, but now... It's actually taking me a few attempts to do it. Like a spring breeze to the edge. We're fine though. Nope, we're fine. Just gotta do this once more. Hard. You just can't get enough jump. And these curtains are hella annoying. Feel like a new sponge. Fresh like a spring breeze. Right, there we go. 
finally got it. <laughs> Only took two attempts. Okay, the first and the last time. The first time I did it, that took me like eight attempts. <laughs> I always forget where you enter the slide. What? Nope. That's not where I wanted to go. Anyway. I want to get that sun. Are you kidding me? Well, I guess I won't be getting that sock because I forgot the box. Oh, yeah! Oh, that feels so much better. Uh -huh. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Uh, what if I just gave you this? Well, that's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!